Hi guys, um, wish me luck because uh, tomorrow is one of my biggest day and the truth is I am so nervous and excited as well. By the title of this video, I know that you already understood what I mean. So wish me luck, um, I will keep you updated about the process tomorrow. For now, I uh, let me sleep. See you in the morning. Keep on watching. Lots of rumors about uh, the vaccine. They said that uh, to have a vaccine, it is very risky to those who have a health issue, that it will trigger your health. So uh, I am really afraid. First, I really had that number of opportunity before but I said uh, no and uh, that's the reason I was afraid so by now I think I have to grab uh, this opportunity since teachers are one of you know a frontliner we are so exposed of going outside so hopefully guys pray for me that uh, there will be no bad happening to me. Hopefully it will go well. I have my keep one, my priority number. Vaccination priority up to 11, I mean 10 a.m. After 10 a.m. slot will be given to waitlisted resident signed by Vice Mayor Godfrey uh, Alcantara, Chairman Vaccination Program. Uh, meaning before 10 a.m. I will go to the vaccination center. So Samahanya po guys, hanggang bukas, hanggang sa journey na vaccination, journey ko. Please, be with me of my whole journey. It is very important to eat something before you go for the vaccination. So, I am having rice with tenola so that it gives me more energy. And now, I am all set for heading towards the vaccination center. Now guys, as you can see, it's already raining outside and I'm waiting for the tricycle to drop me to the center. My vaccination center is in Esabal, which is almost uh, 5 to 10 minutes from the place where I live. And now I finally reached to the destination. This place is well known as Galikan Center. This is the only place where you can get 
the COVID-19 vaccination in Isabel. So the inside scenario looks like that. It is mandatory for everyone to wear face mask. As you can see, everybody is wearing face mask. So I am in the second row. So this is the second row. And that's the second one. That was after uh, mag um, na ka in charge of the world. That was uh, mag move naman kami sa dito sa baba. Then, uh, here. Then, after that, mag move naman kami doon sa. We will move there for now. We will wait for our turn. So we have to we have to wear our face shield and face mask. You know, people here are maintaining proper social distancing and the chairs are positioned in such a way that nobody can sit closer to each other. There is a priority lane for the senior citizens, PWD, and pregnant women. So guys, this is the registration point where they will ask your coupons, your name, and also to verify your identification card. But please make sure to bring your own bullpen. And now finally, this is the time for which I was so nervous and equally excited, guys. I ask her, is it allowed to go outside after vaccination? Then she said, of course, but we need to maintain the proper COVID measures. So they will put a sticker like this, which you can uh, remove whenever you want to. For the observation, they will ask you to wait for 10 minutes to see the reactions. After 10 minutes of observation, when they noticed us that we are doing well, then they let us go. But it was raining outside like cats and dogs. And in the part 2 video, I will tell you more about vaccination experience. Thank you so much for watching. God bless.